Hello, my little humans and other possible beings. Um, today it's time for a book-related video, yay! And I'm saying book-related because I don't have a topic for this one because it's not something I'm gonna keep to, but it's a special thing. Today I want to talk about books <laughs> and why I started reading, why I keep doing it, and why I love it and everything. So first of all, I am dyslectic. My family and stuff guessed that I was dyslectic, but I didn't like test anything until I was in uh, the university, which is bad, because otherwise my Swedish and English grades would be so much better. When I was supposed to start learning to read, I wasn't a big fan of it. I remember this green little book, the girl drawn on, on the front of it and sitting by the kitchen table uh, with my dad and just struggling for it. For Christmas I got a book for some reason, I have no clue. It was, I know it was for my sister and her husband. I have no clue why she gave it to me since I didn't really, from my perspective at least, have any interest in reading. Uh, it was the first Harry Potter book, Philosopher's Stone, that's what it's called right in English. It was amazing. Oh, the, the magic. I, I, as, as you know, if you watch anything on this channel, I am a big fan of fantasy books. And um, that might be because it was the first book I fell for Harry Potter. Gosh, it's amazingly written. So that was the first series. And then I read books about Orion. Orion? Arian. I don't know how you say her name in English, but these books by this person for people. I haven't always, I don't only read fantasy books, I also like like young teen girl books, I read a couple of those. Uh, the ones about uh, Georgia Nicholson. Oh my gosh, they're so hilarious. <sighs> I love books. I, I, I like the way that they just take hold of you and bring you to this beautiful magical place where everything and anything is possible. I discuss this with my friends that don't read. So I have a very vivid imagination. I get pictures in my head just by talking. That is really disturbing sometimes. And when I read it, I don't see the text. I see characters and what's happening in my head. And my friends that don't read, they see the text. So first of all, I'm wondering, when you read, what do you see? Do you see pictures in your head or do you see the text? And my second question is, why do you like to read? Because I... Do you think you do like reading since you're here? Otherwise, why would you be here? <laughs> I'm a horrible person, but that's a true question. Why wouldn't you be here if you didn't like books? Huh? Have you always liked reading, or what was it that got you started? I know I do it, but I don't know why other people do. So please tell me. Uh, this is actually everything for today. Uh, I am planning to do uh, another author special. Um, there is a book review coming up about books about the twins and I'm going to present the next book I am reading, hopefully. So that is the book related videos in the upcoming future. <laughs> um, so have a great time, until next time, and I will see you soon. <laughs> Bye!